what's up everybody well back to my channel my name is Holly Trees. i'm back with another video in today's video we are going to do an amazon unboxing do i look crusty hopefully i don't look crusty um i literally just got out the bed i'm still in my pajamas i haven't even gone to look at myself or nothing i just woke up the amazon man woke me up um and it was back at my door so yeah i haven't done anything yet but anyways um let's just get right to this unboxing oh my god i already unboxed it it's already out the box just can we just take a second oh my god And for reference, I just pulled out. Oh. <sighs> I got this off of Amazon, Blood Mart. I didn't want to. Oh, Bert. I didn't want to risk going to a bookstore and it not being there because it it was gonna piss me off. So I was like, you know what? Let me just order it off of Amazon and it is here. Oh my gosh. It's here. It's beautiful. I am in love. This book feels... Okay. I thought so. Because this book feels a lot heavier than this one. Um. So, yeah. I got Legendborn book two. It is called Blood Marks. And I am so ready for this book oh my god um brie really annoyed me in legendborn like she really annoyed me in legendborn so hopefully she doesn't annoy me in bloodmarked but um yeah oh my gosh oh my goodness oh my goodness and the first page when you open it For every black girl who was the first. Why are you playing with me? For every black girl who was the first. This is so beautiful. I love it so, so much. I cannot wait to read this freaking book. Um. Oh my God. I cannot wait to read this freaking book. Miss Tracy Dion. I love her writing style. I love this book. I don't love this book, but like I I actually did like Legendborn. I I liked Legendborn. So Blood Marks, I'm pretty sure I'm gonna like this too. Um, oh my goodness. I'm so ready for this book. I am so ready to read this book. This book is thicker um yeah and i think this was the longest book i read too this book is like this one legend one is like 500 pages it was the longest book i read and this one is 560 yeah this one is 560 so this will actually be the longest book i read So, yeah, that was the first thing I got. And the second thing I got was this Got To Be glue. So, if y'all don't know, I use Got To Be on my eyebrows. I use the regular Got To Be um, out of the tube, right? And so, I guess Got To Be caught one of that and they decided to make a brow gel. Um, this is Got To Be glued for brows and edges. I'm only going to use this on my brows. Um, but it's a two-in-one gel and it should have strong hold. See, it's for brows and it's for edges. So we're just going to see. Well, actually, we're not going to see, but I'm going to unbox it for y'all because I need to shower and things like So, yeah. Oh, wow. Okay. So this is the tube. It's a lot of products. Okay. Um... And it's literally a gel so one side is for applying and then this side i believe is for styling so do you see the difference in the brush 
one side is for applying and then the bottom here is for styling so yeah but it's a nice big tube and a lot of product comes in here so yeah got to be has edge edge gel and brow gel um but yeah i'm only gonna use this on my i'm gonna stick to using the tube for my edges and oh it's made in germany i didn't know that made in germany it is a 16 milliliter tube yeah are the ingredients on here i'm gonna put your number in a cardboard box do not use this on eyelashes ladies no the ingredients i don't see them they're probably on the website that's what i've noticed with it with a lot of products if the ingredients isn't on the the tube they put them on the website or let me check the box hold on okay see the ingredients are covered up they're trying to play me they're trying to play me Okay, so there is the same ingredient, um, DMDM Hansenon. That ingredient uh, causes cancer, and it is in the brow gel, and it can cause your edges. It can cause, it causes hair loss, and it apparently causes cancer. Cancer, but I was um, on TikTok. And it was like the amount that they put in the products, the amount that they use in products doesn't, um, is nowhere near the amount that you can use to, that causes cancer. Um, but yeah, to be honest, I feel like, I feel like everything causes cancer. So it's like, you, you really be, you really got to pick and choose, you know, what you use or whatever. Cause I feel like everything causes cancer, like lotions, um, some ingredients in lotion, some ingredients in it, in a fast. I feel like if you eat Burger King, if you eat Burger King chicken nuggets, you should be fine. You know what I'm saying? You shouldn't even be complaining about, about any of that. You get what I'm saying? Um, and this is not like I'm going to be using this product every day. Um, I literally don't even do my edges every day or my eyebrows every day. So I'm not going to be using this product. Even with the got to be glue, since I know that product is in there, um, I don't even use it that much. I don't even use it on my edges that much. Um, so, yeah, that's just FYI if you care about that kind of stuff. Um, and it's so funny because I know people that was talking about eco the ingredients of eco silage gel it causes cancer but they still eating fast food and they still you know what i'm saying like it's like at this point we all gonna die anyway so it's like I don't know. That's just that's generally how I feel. I feel like at this point, at this point in my life, we're all we all have a death date. You can't control how you're gonna die. You can't, um, you know, you can't escape death. Death is literally coming for everybody one day. Um, so at this point, just enjoy your life. Like, just enjoy your life honestly like do what you want we all we're all gonna die anyway there's no escaping it now if there was a way to escape death i would be like okay i would try to be the healthiest motherfucker on the planet but we, there's no escaping it we're literally all gonna die um and the fact of the matter is your death you can't even control how you're gonna die or when you're gonna die so do what you want anyways yeah got to be glue came out with a brow gel boom boom 
um and this just goes to show you that if enough people use a product a different way they will come out with a product specifically for that way you get what i'm saying like got to be glue was never meant for you to put it on your eyebrows but we figured out that trick and it started going viral and guess what they made a got to be for your eyebrows Which it does make sense because got to be is, I believe, a hair gel, correct? It's used for hair, right? Brows, what are your eyebrows? Your eyebrows are hair, correct? So, with that being said, yeah. Okay. Um, But yeah, y'all, I am about to, number one, get my ass in the shower, wash my face, brush my teeth, um yeah how do i look when i first wake up in the morning i woke up like this when i'm playing um actually i'm not i literally just woke up but um i'm going to get my ass in the shower do do my self-care whatever and then i'm going to read blood mark nobody better not call me and ask me to go out because bitch i'm not i got my book fuck you you had four days prior and none of my book is here we're gonna read and read and read okay y'all so i'm done thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe do not spoil this book um that's number one number two if you have already read legend born let me know what you thought about it what did you think what were your what were your thoughts um do not tell me about blood marks. I swear to God, if you spoil this book for me, I will block you. The silent pause give it gives it effect, you know. <laughs> the silent pause gives it effect. Like I'm not playing. I will. I will block your ass. Okay. Um. Actually, you know what? Because I know somebody's gonna try to be funny. So I just might turn the comments off because I'm not, I'm not playing with y'all. Um, so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you follow me on Instagram. My Instagram is Kyla Trees. Make sure you follow me on TikTok. I'm more active on TikTok than I am any other platform. My TikTok is Kyla Latrice 98. Um, but if you are trying to get in contact with me, my Instagram is the way to go. Yeah, if you're trying to get in contact with me for anything, my Instagram is definitely the way to go. Yeah. All right. I'll see you in the next video. Peace.